Hello and welcome back to, or welcome, first time to the game called Would You Rather. It's a game where you choose would you rather have this or this. And it's pretty fun. And I can't wait. I've seen other people play it. That's how I got the idea. Because, well, I can't really find anything. But, you know. It's it's fun. Okay, so would you rather be horribly depressed or horribly and hopelessly depressed or have inescapable overwhelming ex anxiety? Anxiety. And I'm one of the majority. Yep. Would you rather have the beginning of the circle of life play when you farted? Okay. Okay. Or have the chorus of Thriller play when you burp. Um. I'd probably choose Thriller. Because, well, I don't I don't burp that often. This just happens all the time. Apparently. No. But would you rather have the ability to pull out of your pockets the exact change needed for any purchase... Or have the ability to discreetly read minds. Hmm. Yeah, my mic. Um. I, I. I mean, this would be great. So I could buy whatever I wanted. So I could just pull out my pull out my pockets like a credit card for like that exact money, or be able to read minds. I think being able to read minds, it would kind of eliminate somebody's freedom because, well, people, you can read people's minds. If you could read people's minds, it would take away one of their freedoms because people have some freedoms, but, you know, one thing that people don't have that people, that other people don't need or the one thing that gives them power is the ability that they can think and nobody else can see it. So I think having exact change would be amazing. I could buy a car, buy a house, pull out of my pockets the exact change needed, needed for any purchase. That would be amazing. Oh, apparently people don't like, apparently guys don't think of other people's freedoms. I just think it would be terrible. And also, it'd be really... Would you rather eat buffalo wings for the rest of your life or only drink buffalo sauce? Well, eating buffalo wings wouldn't be terrible, but drinking buffalo sauce for my entire life would be pretty want to. No, I like drinking things. It, I'd rather do Buffalo. Yeah, <laughs> 93% agree with me. Okay. That lonely 7% of people. <laughs> yeah. Would you rather sleep on the floor wearing PJs but have no or sleep on the floor entirely naked but have one pillow. Well, it depends. How hard is the floor? If the floor is like hard floor, then I would rather have that pillow. I like pillow better than clothes. But 49%. I. It was pretty evenly split. That bad. Only by about 10,000 people. Okay, would you rather randomly go limp or be deaf? I'd much rather go limp than be deaf. Yep. What's that 26%? Why do people want to be deaf? I guess it would be interesting, but you can't hear anything. You could live on like that, randomly go limp. Well, actually, it does depend on how long. 
I yeah. If you had superpowers of an unknown origin, would you rather allow the government to experiment on me or not allow the government to experiment on me? Well, it depends on the severity of the experiment. Is it like, oh, you gotta, uh, like, is it examining, examining you, or are you getting dissected? If you're getting dissected, then... Nope. I think allowing the government to experiment on me, I think, I don't think they would be that bad on, that bad, and I'll get to work with the government. So I don't think it'd be terrible. Oh, okay. Apparently, eighty-six percent of people think no. Screw the government. Would you rather have your blood sucked by a vampire or brain eaten by zombies? Well, I don't want to be a zombie. 89% of people agree with me. Would you rather constantly have a 40-pound weight on your shoulders or constantly have 10-pound weights on each of your feet? Well, with that, you would just have a hunch back all the time. With that, your calves would look great. Your legs would be easy. Yes. Yeah. Legs would be so strong. Be able to kick things ever everywhere. Would you rather only write in cursive or only type in caps? Hmm. Well, only typing caps that would make everything extremely annoying. Writing cursive would look great. Okay. Yep. People agree. <laughs> Apparently, these this thirty two percent of people, they just want to be extremely annoying. All the time. Would you rather fight all of the original Power Rangers in the Megazoid Robot or fight Optimus Prime? Hmm. I've never seen Power Rangers. I've seen Optimus Prime. Optimus is a badass. Probably kick that whatever the fuck that is ass. So... Um, fight them. Um, the real question is, who would I die by quicker? And it depends also, what I have, what would I have? Would I be running out at them fist fighting? Or, would they just be running out at them fist fighting and then they just step on me? Or, let me say this. 52% agree with me, so I guess it's not that bad. Optimus Prime is too OP. They are pretty OP. Okay. Pain or annoyance? Would you rather get a paper cut on your hand once a week or have one foot fall asleep every third hour for 30 minutes? Wait, what? Wouldn't they eventually overlap? Every third hour. Oh, every third hour. I thought it said third of an hour. So, um, I'd rather have annoyance. People would rather have pain? Why? A paper cut? I hate paper cuts. And they're not even painful. They're just... I kind of like my foot falling, so you get, like, a tingly feeling. I kind of like it. But it would be annoying. Would you rather be a carrot or a cucumber? Carrot. Yeah! Would you rather be a capitalist or a communist? I don't do politics. Okay, people agree with me. I'm 14, I don't do politics! Never, would you rather never have to go to grocery shopping again or never have to do laundry again? Um. I could, I could do that. This, this is better. Oh, wow. Okay, I guess I'm going to leave this up to you. And if you like, if you like this, then leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you in the